I discovered Strawberry Fields on a friend's bookshelf the other day and was intrigued by the off-kilter cover with its colorful graphics and was pulled in by the description on the book jacket. I loved Marina's ability to communicate Dog's point of view alongside of and interspersed between other characters' points of view, told in alternating passages in each one's voice including a series of letters written by one character to his sister who has gone missing. In one letter, there is a description of England as a rain-struck land, and in another letter, he describes being blessed with daily manifestos of his goodness. LaVisca uses foreigners' grammar and syntax, as well as funny spellings of things, which help us feel what it must be like to be stranded in a different language and culture and to help us feel the same confusion that these non-native English speakers must feel when trying to decipher a new language spoken by other foreigners. A big thank you to Marina for writing this book, and I cannot wait to read more of her work. Bye, Ishmael.